it. Thank you, Samantha. A Fort Worth police officer who survived being hit by a car spoke to NBC5 about that close call. And we're getting a look at the shocking dash camera video that shows the moment of impact. The wreck happened along I-30 near Oakland Boulevard. The officer pulled someone over on the shoulder, then another car came barreling, hitting the officer's squad car, then the officer himself. NBC 5's Alice Barr has the story. The signs are fading. Paint marks and a scuff on the highway. All I remember is I hit the ground. A scar on Officer Matthew Lassell's forehead. The memory is clear as day. It was uh, July 7th. Uh, around three in the morning. Officer LaSalle had pulled someone over for a traffic stop, but when he got to the car... Um, the next thing I knew is I was flying through the air. It felt like I was spinning through a washing machine. An accused drunk driver had slammed into him, and he's lying in the middle of I-30. And then telling myself, hey, you're in the middle of the road. You need to get out of the road. He managed to run off the highway just as more cars start zipping by. From all my training, whether it be from uh, the Marine Corps or through the academy, you know, the, the worst thing to do is, is be down and out of a, uh, of a fight. In fact, Officer LaSalle went back out to hold the driver who hit him until his backup arrived. My assist got, you know, there and was like, dude, come, come sit down, take a deep breath. His wife, Danielle, yeah. needed the same advice. I burst into tears. And I literally felt like somebody was squeezing my heart. She's a trauma nurse and knows how much worse this could have been. I think about it every time he walks out the door, but that doesn't, I can't stop.